Welcome back to my channel, SciTechGuru. In this video, I'm going to talk about the Realme GT Neo 2. Is it worth for waiting for this smartphone or should you buy any other device from the Flipkart or Amazon sales? This is a question which I'm getting from a lot of subscribers as you can see from these are the comments. So, so many comments I'm getting regarding the Realme GT Neo 2. So, should they wait or should they buy any smartphone in the big billion day sales or Amazon website as you can see exactly. So these are the questions which I'm getting regular reference, not one, not three, but so many comments just today only I started to receive on this Realme GT Neo 2. Should they buy this device or should they buy any other smartphone from the Flipkart big billion day sale? So this video will definitely give you the clear idea what is going on. I did create a separate playlist as well for the Realme GT Neo 2 users. So in case if you want to know more details about the Realme GT Neo 2, make sure you check the playlist which will give the clear idea what is going on as well. So first thing, if you are a gamer if only only if you are a gamer try to wait for the realme gt neo 2 the main reason is because the realme gt neo 2 has got the different type of cooling system which is present in this phone that's what uh, they did highlight in the chinese launch event as well so which has got the diamond particles are coated so which is a snapdragon 870 chipset so usually the snapdragon 870 chipset is really good i mean in terms of the power and performance in in terms of not eating much as well there's no issues with the snapdragon 870 this is like perfect combination if you want egg them performance and not heating much is very good i do have the iq7 and mlnx device they don't heat up much but they give a lot of performance as well that's the one thing but in case if you want to do little bit kind of more performance if you want to keep the device really cool the phone comes with the diamond as you can see thermal paste with the diamond particles to keep this snapdragon 870 cool that is what the specialty of this realme gto neo 2 is that's the one thing which i'll definitely advise you to wait for this realme gt neo 2 in case if you're planning to buy a phone for the gaming purpose this can be slightly better in terms of the cooling system that is what do we do need while gaming the the more cooler the phone is the more performance stable it will be there for long time gaming and second advantage can be regarding the connectivity wise as well the device has got the 360 degrees connectivity which means there are 11 antennas present in this device that is what the chinese advertisement did it do regarding this phone so which will have really good very strong signals not only wi-fi even the 4g signals also can be slightly better and we do get for more 5g bands obviously from the realme phones the trend we are seeing like uh, more 5g bands maybe close to six to seven 5g bands so if you're planning to buy a phone as a future proof option it's better to wait for this device as well in, the, in terms of the connectivity. So this is going to be really good in terms of the connectivity. So if they don't change any specifications, if they release in India as it is, then that will be a really good deal. So there are other things like about the 600Hz start sampling rate and 120Hz adaptive refresh rate. So right now we, the phone can actually change 30Hz and 60Hz and 90Hz and 120Hz. So this is the adaptive refresh rate with the phone has got. That's another uh, good advantage which the Realme G2 Neo 2 has also has and uh, 600Hz touch sampling rate. That's quite double the IQ7 touch sampling rate you are getting in the Realme GT Neo 2. And finally, something to do with the battery, which is 5000 mAh of battery friends, which is quite, quite significant improvement and 65 watts charger in 36 minutes of time, only 36, 5000 mAh of battery. That is quite amazing to see this kind of performance. So overall, it makes a lot of sense to wait for the Realme GT device, GT Neo 2. But only thing is that what will be the price for this Realme GT Neo 2? That's what the confusion a lot of users are actually having. Even myself, I do have the confusion. I'm not sure exactly how the Realme strategy is exact. They want to they want the phone to be sale or they want more profits. I'm not sure. If they want the phone to be sale more, then they should keep the price of this phone client slightly kind of close to 30,000. 30,000 right now should be a very very biggest deal for the Realme GT Neo 2. I'm not sure whether that will happen or not at this minute. So maybe if they keep 32,000, if they give the bank discount cards, if you use some bank discount, you can get additional like 2,000 discount. That also works better. So let's see what's going to happen. Only the price is the one thing which is stopping me from recommending this phone. So very soon we'll be able to know about the release and everything, all the details. So stay tuned for those videos as well, friends. But overall, it makes sense for the gamers to wait for this device. So that's it friends. Thank you for watching this video. And in case if you have any other queries, let me know in the comment section below. Meanwhile, signing off and bye.